Well, Soma is one of the fastest growing neighborhoods in Little Rock. It's hip, trendy, and full of great places to see, eat, and play. But now it's becoming an even cooler place to stay. We're taking you to an architectural gym unlike any house you've seen before. Nestled in an unassuming neighborhood, is a home you can't take your eyes off of. Just from the outside, you're like, what is this place? Right. Interesting appearance, interesting story. It was built by University of Arkansas students in Fayetteville. In 2010, fourth and fifth year students did it as a uh, project where they built it in a warehouse in four different pieces. They were trying to do um, an economical and sustainable type of build. Josh fell in love with the home and after a year bought it for himself. But he soon realized how many people wanted to see and use the unique space. Let my friend use it for a birthday party where I'd listed it on Airbnb. Then it sort of blew up and so then it made me think, oh, I could really do this. The rest is history. The home is now used for Airbnb specifically right, so and is booked one almost one every day. So it feels very big and open in here. Yeah, it's really only, you know, four rooms in the home. Uh huh. But most like open concept. Yeah. And so tell me a little bit. I'm really interested in this whole thing you got up here. I mean, what is it because you have so many visitors from all over yeah, the world? Yeah, we had a group from Germany for two weeks, um, a group from Australia for a, a whole week and then short stays from a lot of other places. It's no surprise visitors come from across the world. They learn the space is arguably even cooler inside than outside. It's full of memorable, one-of-a-kind quirks. You are the mastermind and artist behind these unique paintings. I mean, where did you come up with this? You know, I'd, I'd never... Uh tried painting. I, I'd always wanted to. And uh, really what led to these is the random rhino head that I have over here. And oh, I kind of wow. thought that that was a, you know, a fun thing to have an, an animal theme. And so these are the first two paintings I ever did. The fun theme bodes well for big groups and tasteful party animals that often book the home. You say you have a lot of people come here in groups for parties or events and I mean it's the perfect kitchen for it. Right, yeah, it's pretty open and uh, you know even if you are cooking you can interact with all your guests. I have two weddings this spring coming up, um, a wedding reception in the fall. You heard that right, weddings right in the backyard. The wedding that's uh, happening is actually happening back here, the one this spring, and then in the fall, the reception's happening uh, back here. There's a lot of area to entertain. But after the entertainment comes rest, and the intentional touches of unique art and style continues to the bedrooms. So two bedrooms, one bathroom, but this one is like the heart of the whole Soma vibe, right? Right. Whenever I made it in Airbnb, I kind of wanted to bring some attention to the area and, and you know, all that Soma has to offer. But I kind of wanted to to bring fun to the area. And surprisingly, the bathroom. So you tell me there's actually a cool backstory behind this sink, which I never thought I would say, wow, what a great sink, but that's cool. Right. <laughs> the students all, you know, their grade depended on specific areas of the home that they were responsible for. That's cool that all these students have a small part in making this mm -hmm. house what it is. We may never know what student was responsible for the front porch outdoor sanctuary, but they should have gotten an A+. Plus. That big hammock? is a nice touch for guests and news crews. Okay, yep. I'll, I'll, I'll work later, rest now. <laughs> it's the perfect way to end the day in this fun, quirky home with a personality of its own.